see in this cutscene. I'm just gonna skip to where we were. Which is literally right here, because this is where issues happened yesterday, because I just shut off the Xbox due to technical difficulties. Oi! Noi! A fighter. State your... Looks of him. He knows how to use that blade. Thought you'd agree. My, My apologies for the dramatics, but I wanted Ned here. He. If you have business with me, then. St Cecily, at your service. And what is it you promote? Arena battles mostly, and the men who fight them. Except Cecily here's done neither yet. Still looking for a big break, she is. Stay your tongue, Ned. I do the talking, remember? You want to meet the man Gustav, yes? Very. You were there when I spoke to the Barker. That's right. And I'll tell you something he didn't. Tourney fighters don't make a habit of fraternizing with the hoi polloi. If you and he were old friends, that'd be one thing. But something tells me he's not expecting your visit. He knows the man who... Do you have a point? Killed my king. I have advice. If you want to talk to Gustav, your best play would be to fight in the tourney yourself. But how? The preliminary rounds are already over, or so I heard. <laughs> See? This is why you need me. I know a way you can get around that. Then tell me. Simply prove that you're a better fighter than one of the remaining champions, and make sure everyone sees it. During the tourney, local authorities turn a blind eye to public dueling. It's still against the law, mind you, but no one gets in trouble for it. Lots of men come here fancying themselves good with a blade, and they look to prove it, whether they qualify for the tourney or no. But surely, those who have qualified are above getting involved in petty brawls. I don't know, I've run around They're challenging the few short people in this same game. Same as everyone. If the circumstances are right, they can no more shirk a challenge outside the arena than in it. I'm telling you, this is your ticket to the tourney. Get the attention of one of the champions and make them challenge you. Oh, a good Put thing them in a position up, huh? where they've no choice but to prove they're your better with a blade. And what do you get out of all of this? I was gonna say, what is, what's the point of helping me? When you do get into the tourney, you'll fight under my colors. If you reach the final battle, I'll have fighters lining up to put their seal on a contract with me. Ah, a deal where we both benefit. Is there a better kind? I'll get my scribe to draw up the contract. What name will you use? My own. Olberich Eisenberg. Eisenberg? The unbending blade of Hornberg himself? A fine figure. And famous, too. <laughs> Told you I could pick him, Ned. My lordship. I think this partnership is going to work out handsomely. Let's let's go dealing, I suppose. At me, punk. You there. Pshaw. You 
you don't stand a chance against my level 60 something. Let us fight with honor. The battle is. Oh my the god, he did is... one more damage. I play this unbent. I wreak havoc upon thee. <laughs> ah, the thrill of the fight. The hell? Prepare yourself. All right. Prideful warrior, you don't stand a chance either. Let us fight with honor. Have at you. Ha! Now then, out of my way. Now then, have at you. I pray this on. Yeah, I probably don't Watch even need to do the mega ones. Ah, the thrill of the fight. I'm really glad I let him see if I were above level. Hang me. Is she just promoting me, ma'am? I don't want to be famous. Truly? Just so. Now at me, punk. That's right. I am level sixty two and cannot die, but probably in this fight, even if I wanted to. Nothing. 
I am so far above that on this fight. My goodness. No. Out of my way. I could die even if I wanted to. Like, I am way too far above level. Oh no. Here goes nothing. My. I'm ready. Are you? Time to steal the show. Will you survive that one? Or will you survive this one? Ever help us. With each battle, Easy peasy. I grow Tournament, yay! That's right. Something, something being level. I think I'm doing this tourney just so I can talk to someone. <laughs> I see. Guys, we were place in the Grand Tourney before long rumors of a great night. The last remnant of a fallen realm spread across every alehouse in town. All claimed to have witnessed the battle. Any more than stood in the plaza that day. <laughs> Spoke in awe of the speed and strength of his blade. Wait, am I becoming famous? I don't think that's a good idea. Anyway, Mike, Nothing. how are you doing this morning? It's so cold. Uh, yeah, I'm I'm cold. That's kind of why I woke up a bit late. I was comfy in bed. I was under two blankets and did not want to get up. Good. And now I'm awake and in my chair and I'm cold in here. Gather round. I've got my blankies with me. All right, let's let's tourney arc. Coming up! This tournament underway. Do it! Go! <laughs> Coming up! Conveniently going to be the last one mentioned. Burn hard. Say what? Are you ready? Free. Talk Do to you. it! Coming up! Over it! 
What the? That's Time it. to wipe the floor <laughs> with this tournament as my high level self. That's all. Let's wipe the floor. Greetings. Um, I'm supposed to be talking to you. I That's see. why I'm doing this. <laughs> Oh, he already knows I'm looking for air turn. Yeah, that's why I'm here. I got so. wrapped up in this. I got wrapped up into this man. <laughs> I have to win the tournament. I see. Oh, don't worry about it, Mike. Sinky take you through the words that she said. It just meant that she just wanted me to watch because Rick may have been a troll. Alright. Anyway, do I have to win this tournament? So... Yeah. <sighs> yeah, let's fight. I mean, tourney style. Alright, time to wipe the floor is the, like, 40 levels above this that I am. Prepare, then talk. Okay. Oh, and I got my SP back. Oh, well then we're really gonna wipe the floor. These punks don't stand a chance. Are you ready? Or there. <laughs> well. These punks don't stand a chance. I'm so far above <laughs> level. Do it! At your service. I am Ulberic. Hmm? All right. Yes. Let's go, buddy. I am. Begin. I will not fail. Hang on. I thought this is a duel. Why does he have friends? Well, I have friends too. Bring but... it on. <laughs> The Steve battle is truly <laughs> my turn. What kind of duel is this? Oh no, he hit me for seven damage. Oh god. <laughs> How will I ever? <laughs> now, what next? Uh, uh, here we go. <laughs> 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 How about you? Out of my way! Out of my way. Uh, not really, Mike. We'll see. I'm not what sure. do this. Time to steal the show. Than usual. Oh look, I Don't start things you can't finish. Don't start things you can't finish. Oh, and I'll break level up. That's so convenient. <sighs> the thrill of the fight. Anyway, I wiped the floor. <laughs> let's let's wipe the floor with this tournament. Oh, we're fighting the reigning champion. Well, don't worry, he won't stand a chance against my forty high levels above this. So like this. Oi, oi. <laughs> Are you ready? Take care now. We don't go to go inside. Neither do I. It's a good thing I'm kind of content to just stay inside. It's, it's, it's chilly. Wow! A 
Is it so? Hi. Well. <laughs> On your guard. I will not fail. A defensive posture, buddy. You don't stand a chance. Even Victory if you power up, you don't yeah. stand a chance, man. <laughs> now, what next? Here we go. Mega here hit me first. <laughs> I appreciate that. That was really? pathetic, man. That was 161. What kind of hit was that? No, the dagger stands. What <laughs> do this? Time to steal the show. Here goes nothing. What is the Tell me how much HP does this punk have? So 4,000? Okay. The I can do that. My blade is unbending! Watch my blade dance. Oh, I was just off. I just wanted to do the mega hit. Huh. Let's get the chest! <laughs> That's what I'm talking about. These tourney ears are no match for me. That's all. Stood a chance. Are you ready? No. <laughs> Leave, sir. Good. Now I simply have to win second place out of the question. Oh, don't worry, I wasn't <laughs> planning on losing anyway. Truth be told. Indeed. Let's let's win. Hmm. Mm. Make sure you use all your strength. Okay, but I'm not going <laughs> to lose anyway. Ouch. Coming up. No. Let's go fuck this guy up. Greetings. Whoa. <laughs> hmm. Hmm. 
Indeed. Prepare yourself. Begin. This punk never stood a chance. I will not fail. Impenetrable. Nothing is impenetrable. <laughs> All right. Victory shall be. Interesting. <laughs> Here. <laughs> Here goes nothing. Oh no, she had new damage. However, will this I recover off of this curse? Oop, I won. That works too, I suppose. My turn. Try this. Me, who has 5,000 HP. How will I All ever right. recover off of... Yeah. See, he can take a bit of damage. Well, what next? Oh, I had enough to do. What? I'm ready. Are you? Time to steal the show. Victory show. Here goes. Let's get down to work. It's axe, and I have axe. No, my way is unbending. Ever help us? Here goes nothing. What have we here? Okay, it's 3,000 HP. Oh, I can do that. My turn. I appreciate it. Really? No. Oops. Easy peasy. The thrill of the fight. I win the tournament, right? Because I'm cool like that. Damn it. We have a winner. Stood a chance this poor <laughs> tournament. Well played. Now, anyway, can you tell me where Earhart is? Because that's Agreed. why I was here. Is it so? So. I'm just here to find someone. That's what this tournament was for. As you wish. Now I get to be famous, and I don't want to be famous. Gather round! Holy. I'm invincible. Well, technically, yes, but no.
I am the champion now. Now I'm famous, and I think that's a bad thing because I'm not just gonna tell the one guy that I'm here. Ah, welcome. Make yourself comfortable. Please just tell me where Earhart is. The deal's is. a deal. You want to find Earhart, and I'll honor my side of the bargain. But let's take it slow. There's much we have to talk about, you and I. If you say so. But what about? Sir Earhart, of course, and what I know of him. I'm listening. Now, where to begin? Just tell me where he went. That's all I need to know. Tell me, Sir Ulberic, are you familiar with the land from which Sir Earhart hailed? Some border town in the far reaches of Hornburg. Or so he once told me. Aye, a peaceful village called Grind. At least it was till it was raised in the war. It was long before Lord Earhart became a knight that he lost his home. After that, he joined a band of swords for a spell. It was there he got an idea in his head. And so he finally came to serve Hornburg and the Crown. Ah, oh, yes, of course, spy. because we know he's a spy. Oh, preposterous. You mean to tell me that Earhart meant to betray he us all along? He betrayed us in the first place, so I'm not too surprised. His eyes always burned with fire when he told the tale. The King of Hornburg turned his back on us, he'd said, and sat on his ass as our homes burned. Nonsense. King Alfred cared for all his subjects. He would never... Lord Earhart claimed otherwise. Either way, he was a man on a mission. If that's true, that means he'd been plotting the downfall of Hornburg for years. Revenge is made all the sweeter by the passage of time. How sweet it must have been for him when Hornburg Okay, so he was a traitor. Past. Okay, I'm, I'm glad we've clarified that part. I don't pretend to admire his deeds, nor claim they are honorable. But then, I've never known the pain and anguish Sir Earhart was forced okay. to Okay, now I feel like just because you go through some bad things in life does not mean eliminate a kingdom! Though I wonder sometimes how it made him feel to see justice done. If winning his revenge put his heart at ease. I never asked him, and he never told me. look up to the man, don't you? He taught me to be a true warrior. And I dare say he was a friend as well. I know of little else but the ways of battle. Whatever his sins might have been, I was proud to call Wipes him kingdom. Yeah, but he taught me how to fight, so you know. As was I. Anyway, can you tell me Thank where he you. is? Happy to have the company and a willing ear. You'll find Sir Earhart in the desert town of Wellspring. Ah! When you do, well, I trust you'll do what's right. Okay. Even if that means I slay him? Your friend, your mentor, your brother. Oh, man. I need to kill him. Maybe if I'll find peace. If that is what you believe he deserves, I reckon he'll accept his fate. And so will I. Whatever the cause he fought for, it does not excuse his deeds. He slew the king. He is a literal a traitor to like to the protect. extreme here. I will listen to what he has to say. That much I can promise you, but no more. He's not gonna like. Oh well, I felt so bad. At this point, he's just gonna be like, "Haha, he deserved it." Does Gustav have the right of it? Did Earhart wield his sword for the sake of revenge? You know what they say about revenge. When embarking on the road to revenge, dig two graves. If so, 
Does he still wield it, even though the thirst for vengeance has been sated? Well, no, because now he's gonna learn that I'm alive. Could it be that we are the same? Has Earhart too lost his purpose? He's gonna learn that I'm alive, and I have a feeling that's not gonna be a good thing. Interesting. off to I have business to attend to the tourney is over what does it matter the tourney is over our bargain is concluded it is but that doesn't mean we can't bid each other Godspeed phew got you in the nick of time we won't let you go sneaking away without so much as a fare thee well fare thee well thanks bye of course Pray forgive my manners. I could not have gotten this far without you. Both of you. I don't know, you I feel like we thanks. could have managed. Pretty, we're pretty smart. And you have ours. So, if I can be so bold, where are you off to next? The Sunlands. A town called Wellspring. To finish what I started here. And then? I don't know. <laughs> Maybe I'll go back to living the peaceful village life. I don't know. Perhaps I'll return ho to the village I came from before here. Well, if you've already got a place to call home, then maybe this means nothing. Oh, are you going to offer a job? But if you're looking for a new line of work, you could do worse than being a full-time champion. <laughs> the offer is welcome. But it's not the life for me. Thought you might say that, but I had to ask, huh? Two to your shot. If you ever have a shot. change of art, just drop on by. Or even if you don't, you'll always be welcome here. Thank you, friend. I may do just that. In the meantime, take care of those wounds. Don't you worry about me. I'll be fighting fit soon enough, and ready to give a good showing at next year's turn. A good showing? Now there's an inspiring goal. If you want to stick around in my stable, I'll see you claim the throne. Oi, oi! One step at a time, me lady. I ain't the unbending blade of Hornburg, after all. <laughs> a title and a crest do not a swordsman make. Just get good uh, scrub. True enough. Maybe I will go and win it all. <laughs> See what the betters will say about that. Tell you what, if they crown Ned King, you come back and we'll put on a duel the likes of which the city's never seen. I'd like that very much. But today, the road calls. Till our paths cross again. And so did Albrecht leave Victus Hollow behind him with new knowledge of Earhart's past and present. Now Book must find Earhart and God's willing the truth, even if it means crossing blades with his erstwhile friend. And so to the sunlands of the desert oasis of Wellspring, Albrecht's journey continues. Yeah, woo! Woo! Go team! We finally did that. Reasons for wielding clear chapter two of Ulbrich's journey. Alright, that means I'm on chapter three for everyone. Oh, that's so convenient. We have to go to the same 32? 32? Oh, I'm way over that.
everyone, everyone just have supposed to be but I honestly don't want to level anymore so I've got that going for me anyway onwards and upwards I suppose the story so far the inquiry crashed to some other fellow merchant named Ali yep he told them the merchants found Grand Port where the greatest treasures in all the realm were put to auction they said us about to find a worthy treasure Hoping to prove herself a merchant worthy of respect and renown, which is why we're here. This is a teacher in the Amis to reunite at the fair. Yeah, and that's why we're here now, right? treasure. It's not going to be as simple as buying the treasure. Most precious treasure. Oh my god, is this a is this a oh. treasure map? Is this a treasure map? Yes. Can I take it? Off of you? No? Okay. Phew! Time for a break! You didn't do anything! What do you mean, time for a break? Walks a block. Woo! I'm tired! Hello there. Oh my god, it's the captain! 
world tour. It's been fun. Oh. Hello. What? You Nick ninny? and Mac. Nick and Mac. Oops. <laughs> you your bird brain ninny. Wow, what an insult. How convenient. It's a reunion for the first chapter. Uh. Mick. Mac. Captain. You don't say. I just don't have a treasure. still has it. Do you still have the map? Hey! Welcome. I'm sorry. Mm -hmm. Show him the map, por favor. What do we have here? He's not a pirate. He's a good guy now. He's a, he's a friendly man. Hmm. This is... Oh my. <laughs> he's an honest making merchant now. I beg your pardon. Hmm. 
but... You found it in a warehouse, you liar. What? You see... Till we meet again. Did he not? Does he not want hey. it? LOL. Boom. Hi. Bye, nice captain. Oh. Good attempt to blackmail, but you failed. I guess I'll take over the trade. I will find that shield. Purchase a bird shield. How much money do we think it is? I'm rich, so it's <laughs> fine. Actually, why don't we just have Therion steal it? No, this transaction needs to be legal, damn it. shield. Was that an honest deal? Wow. <laughs> Kickstand door. Leon, I have a map for you because I bought it. Wasn't even that much trouble finding the shield. <laughs> I literally just had to spend eight thousand and talk to an NPC. It was pretty simple, actually. You see.
ooh, ooh, story time? Story time. They were pirates doing pirate things. What a fun story. The lands of this PC first called this and we used it in our reputation. As it came to be known as the Wild Eagle. And I have the Sea Serpent. Ooh. The ships especially have seen our names were the extended through the skies. They were pirates doing pirate things. Pretty crazy, huh? Captain Leon! The storm be giving us no quarter, sir! Let's turn back! The old girl can't hold on much longer! Anyone wanting to retreat can be my guest and swim back. I'll reduce this ship to shivers before I let him have my treasure! If those scurvy sea dogs get to that island first, we get nothing! You hear? Hold fast to that rudder, matey! Ah, yes. Classic. Uh, aye, aye, sir! Baltazar, that bastard. Did he betray you? You're too slow, Leon. Aye, Captain Marvius. I think he'd have learned after all these years. Enough. Else I'll cut out your tongue and feed it to the gulls. Now I'll be taking this island's treasure if you don't mind. I do mind, but it isn't mine. Do whatever you please. Pirates with honor, my goodness. There's a first time for everything. Do ye remember when we were lads, Leon? Starving in the slum, stealing to survive. We dreamt of just growing up and had to fight tooth and nail to reach the top. Nothing was ever easy for us. In this world, the strong take while the weak quake, and we became strong. Ye never change, Leon. You say it like you're any different, Balthazar. Not everyone stays the same forever, matey. So he was a pirate doing pirate things. Time passed between us until one day. Ooh boy. Can I tell you something? I never wanted to be a pirate. Said every pirate ever. What? When we were lads, I dreamt of being a merchant. <laughs> Have you gone daft? Balthazar of the Eastern Seas. A merchant. You're a bloody scoundrel for laughing. But it be the truth. I wanted to trade treasure from every corner of this here world and bring Is that why Leon's a merchant now? A sight dream of becoming a pirate. These days, it's all I'd be thinking about. Leon. Do you have something precious to you? Fine storm this is. How about another wager, my friend? Whoever reaches that island first be the winner. If you win, you get that gem you always wanted. Oh, uh -huh, will I now? 
And what happens if you win? I win. Ye hand over your most precious treasure. What kind of deal is this? Deal. Oh, okay. What do I know? That's how our final race began, but Bowser. He never emerged from those stormy seas. Oops. I mean, you know. That's what you get for racing in, in storm water, okay? The lesson of the day is don't go out when it's storming. I, that's not the lesson, but. The Eldrite. Take it? Can I take it? And use it at the <laughs> merchant fair? I can see where this is going. Can I borrow your ship? Is it at sea? Okay, where's the map telling me to go? The Forgotten Grotto? Okay, I can do that. Mm -hmm. become rivals and rivals become friends. It's classic, okay? Let's go get that treasure. Level 33 and I'm level 60, it's fine. Where three of us are level 60, one okay, of us is level 35 business. because I got tired of leveling. Out of my way. Level 34. above this to be worthwhile. Or most of me, anyway. Keep on trucking. <laughs> so I'm getting the vibe that we're gonna take the rock thing. and we're gonna use it at the merchant what? fair. I feel like that's kind of pretty that's just my assumption. Or or we're gonna give it to him and he's gonna let us take one of his treasures again. You know, either way. Come on, I've got better things to do. What a man. Out of my way. I've got better things to do. Okay. So much time saving. 
let's fight. Look at that. It's loot, all right. At me thing that wants to fight. What are big kitty, big big kitty. Do this. It's a kitty. Out of my oh, way. Oh, large catho. Venom, venom, to venom, to tiger. Big kitty. Oh. Let's do this. Oh. Victory shall be. Oh. Here we go. Yes, I can't get in my best event. How much strong are you? 52k. Okay. Here goes nothing. And poison hits nothing. like a train. Gem, all right. Wow! Can I use this at the merchant fair? Oh. Oh, and a letter. Oh, I don't think yeah. we should be reading this, kid. Yeah, that's not ours. You obtain. Okay, there was a free teleport back. Excuse me. Neon. Mr. Leon. I have something for you. This letter is yours though, not mine. Huh? Mm -hmm. And it's yours, not mine. And I don't want to read your letter. I'm not... Did you I'm ever not you. find what's most precious to you? 
Musar, a single phrase written on it. Mood. Baltazar. Leon, what's more precious to you than anything in the world? Most precious? All my treasures are precious. <laughs> I didn't mean gold or gems, Leon. Then what did you mean? Do ye have something so dear to your heart that ye'd risk life and limb for it? When we were lads in that poor town, we thought having riches was all there was to life. I've been wondering lately, if that's the life worth living. And then I wonder, what life is worth living. I used my strength to steal from the weak. Just like you, Leon. And it took years of looting to realize that none of it meant anything to me. Oh. What is precious to you, pirate question indeed? After the final race with Balthazar, I couldn't stop thinking about his last words. If I win, you hand over your most precious treasure. What is precious indeed? What was my most precious treasure? In the coming days, I kept asking myself the same question. But I never came to an answer. Until one day, I realized. I'd obtained nothing. Just like Balthazar. I no longer had a reason to continue as a pirate. Pirating is stupid anyway. I lowered my flag. And I dedicated myself to repairing Balthazar's ship. And that's why I you're decided a to pursue the dream of my friend in his stead. That's pretty nice. Anyway, and so, thanks for the story. I became the captain of a merchant ship. Huh. So anyway, do you want this treasure or can I keep it? Thanks, I want it'll... you to keep that stone, lass. It'll be worth really? it. But it belonged to your friend. This letter is all I need. That stone holds no meaning to me. Are you sure? No take backsies. <laughs> Everyone has something precious to them. Whether it be land, riches, honor, or what have you, there is an abundance of treasure in this world. But there is only space in one's heart for a single, truly and precious this, this treasure. This stone is not it. Okay, I, I got it. Thanks for the lesson, I and think. And I found mine. Baltazar's ship. It gave me another chance at life. Mr. Leon? What is your most precious treasure? It's... I'm like, I, I don't know yet. I'm like a kid still. You don't need to have life figured out yet. But I know I'll find it someday. Aye, with those keen eyes, I have no doubt you will. But be prepared. Your life will never be the same after. This is such a life lesson for the kid. Farewell, lass. Bon voyage! Toodaloo! My mom.
most precious treasure. I saw Mr. Leon again. He taught me that there is only one true treasure in a person's life. I haven't found that treasure in my You're life You're like yet. 15! You got time! But I'll keep searching until I do. It's just a matter of time now. Wow, I don't know what my most precious treasure is. You're not even an adult! Hand, I'm ready for the auction. Watch out, Merchant's Fair! Here I come! That's the spirit, though. Am I being stalked? I'm being stalked. Most precious treasure. Here, chapter 3. There's banter. I'd like to hear the banter. Are you alright? Yeah, and I'm still trying to figure out if I'm just gay or if it's meant to be straight. Out of curiosity, it says she should be level 45 for her chapter 4. I don't like that. That's a lot. Save and call it an age, shall we? So far, so good. Um, what day is it? Today's Friday. Let's see. So tomorrow's Christmas Eve, and I will be here. So I'll probably just pick this up tomorrow. Uh, <laughs> it'll be a rare early Saturday stream. I think he said, "Well, stretching." My goodness. Yeah. So far so good with this game at least. I didn't have controller issues today. Ha 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 ha. We will pick this up tomorrow. 